They say a smartphone lifespan is from 2 to 3 years and likely my OnePlus 6 has served me well for the past 4 years but it's now time for an upgrade. With all these brands releasing new models every month, it's hard to keep up and decide which one to opt in. So I decided to stick with the one that I get used to, which is the one that we are featuring in this video. So before we start, please send some love by subscribing to my YouTube channel and if you have any content requests you might think of, feel free to comment it down below. Also, this item has been purchased with my own money and this is not sponsored. Everything in this video comes from my own expenses and for my own use. So as you guys already know by the title of this video, I did went for the OnePlus 9 Pro, the morning mist in specific. And if you ask me why, because I don't want to lose the good stuff such as the Oxygen OS and the Alert Slider which comes in handy. So in this video, I will be showing you the unboxing experience, the setup, few recommended accessories, where I got this item, and few b-rolls for your eyes only. Just a bit disclaimer, I already unboxed this yesterday when I received it just to make sure that I wasn't scammed and thankfully I wasn't. So without further ado, let's do this! Yes, switching to a new phone has been a painful process to all of us, even though that our contact lists are already synced to our Google account. 
Thankfully, OnePlus has a faster and easier solution to get your OnePlus device, new OnePlus device, day one ready. So let me introduce you to the OnePlus Clone Phone app. Switching phone has never been easier with OnePlus solution. This can get all your media content, phone call history, SMS, Android settings, applications, and even its data files and session all over a fast Wi-Fi peer-to-peer connection, no internet needed. A phone is an investment and deserves some protection. Good thing that OnePlus provided the case out of the box, but I still prefer a different protection for my unit. Thankfully, my parcels are just right in time for installation, so let me show you what I got for my OnePlus 9 Pro. Sadly, the stock screen protector is no longer installed and nowhere to find, so I decided to order two hydrogel films to give protection for both the screen and the back panel.
Unfortunately, the stock case attracts too much dirt and even discolored in just a day. Good thing that the new case is now here to give some protection and to showcase that wonderful morning mist design. We all know that camera lenses are the most vulnerable yet fragile part of the phone. Thankfully, there are available tempered glass protectors made to fit the OnePlus 9 Pro. Just look at how clean and aesthetic it looks like with all those protections in the OnePlus 9 Pro. Just to take note that the hydrogel is not a tempered glass replacement which means that it's just a thin film layer between your fingers and your screen so expect some marks over time on the hydrogel. The case is a little bit thick for my liking but it does protect the phone. There is no wobble due to the camera bump and the screen is well protected when lying flat on the surface. And lastly, the lens camera protector will degrade the image quality, but hey, protection is protection. So before we end, I know this unit is a little bit outdated with the OnePlus 10 Pro being pre-ordered around here in the Philippines, I would still open for a lower flagship phone with an affordable price tag. The Snapdragon 888 is still a fast ship, it has the best camera and camera collaboration in this price range, and that immersive screen just amazed me. Let's not forget where I bought this, since OnePlus 9 Pro stock has been limited and it is not officially sold here in the Philippines, I went for an e-commerce platform site called Shopee and bought mine under the store name Digital Ocean. Again, I am not sponsored, I am just someone who wanna share some hidden gems around so feel free to search them, visit them, and who knows, you might get the best deal that they can have for this unit. So yeah, that wraps up my video. Let me know your thoughts about these items in the comment section below and please do like this video if you find it very helpful. See you on the next one. Goodbye!